Good afternoon, guys. Today I'll tell you about how to treat the hidden cavities of a car, specifically wheel arches, using your own hands and some simple tools. I'm going to use my grandfather's pure lard recycled oil. So the first thing, of course, is to remove the wheel, take off the fender liner, and thoroughly rinse everything underneath. I bought two blocks of lard from the market for 30 hryvnias. I don't have an electric cooker, so I'm using four bricks, some firewood, an old saucepan. The lard has already melted. Initially it looked like this, and now it has turned into this. Once it's cooled down a bit, I'm going to add some recycled oil into the mix. I'm aiming for a consistency similar to cream frosting for a cake. I think everyone knows what that's like. I find it convenient to spread these cakes on the treated surface. It's quite simple and easy to apply. Let me show you the two pieces of lard I have here. In a while I'll tell you how much recycled oil will be added and then I'll pour it in and stir it. Once it's cooled down a bit, I'll show you the result. So, the melted lard has been taken off the heat. Now I'm putting on an oven glove. As you can see, it's turned quite liquid like normal butter. Don't worry, it will eventually dry and harden on the car, and it will all be fine. Regarding the lard, well, somewhere here you can see a one and a half liter bottle along with about a liter of recycled oil. I'm going to pour half of the recycled oil in here. Generally speaking, that should be enough, maybe a tiny bit more. It wouldn't hurt. It will all drain, then the car will drain out on the street. So don't park the car in the garage. In the sun it will melt, that's it. I've poured about 700 to 800 grams of oil onto the two blocks. Now it will start to harden a bit and then it will be very easy to spread it on the inside of the arch which has already been cleaned. From three cleaned areas, it's ready to apply the mastic, not exactly mastic, but liquid lard. I'm going to cover the brake drum now to prevent any dripping onto it so it stays clean and not greasy. So, in general, I've done the first arch. Everything here is well coated, especially all the seams. corners where moisture could potentially gather, you can already see it drying up, starting to look like paraffin. Here's a piece, you see, it gets spread like this to create this type of grease. You can see on the surface of the wood where it was dripping, it really does look like paraffin. Here, it seems there's a droplet. You smear it, so be sure to lay down a cloth because it all drips. So, definitely lay down something. Well, in summary, something like this. I'll go and do all four, or rather remaining three arches. So, be sure to subscribe to my channel, watch other videos, follow the drive. Gas 3110 Testronic. Go to the website testronic.ru, there's a lot of information about the technical aspects of the car. But the main thing is information about traveling around the country, not just in your own, but also neighboring countries by car. So good luck to everyone. Bye for now.